Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel where we sip and spill the tea on all my favorite things. And if you can tell, we are doing an ink video today. These are not my best filming videos just because it's not something I do all the time and it's kind of hard to film and capture that. It takes a special YouTuber to be able to film that sort of thing. But I ordered some different calligraphy sets because it's something I do um, try to improve myself on all the time. I like writing letters and things like that. So this one, the video before this was more of a dip pen, a glass dip pen set, whereas this is going to be a more traditional calligraphy pen. And so as you can see, it kind of has this vintage feel to it. It's really, really pretty. It come very well packaged. It opens up. Both sets had really pretty boxes, I have to say. These would be great gifts, you guys. So this set is a little bit different. It kind of, it even has a little kind of calligraphy guide on the back. The paper even feels vintage. I love it. And look at this set, you guys. It's really pretty. Amazon has so many options. It took me a while to really narrow it down on what I wanted to get. This one is pretty cool because if I can get it out with my, nope, we're going to need help with that. All right, my nails are too long. I'm going to have to get out some tweezers. I'm going to take everything out of the box and then I'll come back and show you guys this beautiful set. Okay, I've taken everything out, but I do want to show that along with the nib that comes preloaded in it, you get five additional nibs as well. I'm probably going to be putting mine back in this kit, but I guess I'll take these out because I want to show you guys how ornamental. I have other nibs. Sorry, I know this part is like, come on, Valerie, get your YouTube life together here. <clears throat> Excuse me. You guys, look how detailed these are. I don't know if y'all can see that. They have great detail on them. I have some other nibs. I actually made this little jar when I used to do clay. And they're pretty basic in comparison, right? So you have these nibs versus these really pretty kind of ornamental nibs. So I do want to say that the aesthetics of it feel very old and authentic. You get a nib cleaning wipe or um, little towel to clean off your nibs. I'll scoot that out of the way. Again, I feel out of my element on these videos. I want to share these things with y'all, but bear with me because I don't always know the best filming for it. You actually get a letter opener, and I want you guys to know, I don't know how much this thing weighs, but I'm pretty sure you could knock out a robber with this thing. It is heavy, heavy, heavy. It is so pretty and ornamental. It feels so antique and authentic even though it's just a replica you guys like holding this thing it's so pretty oh i love that and it's not it's not too terribly sharp either just look at it all the way around there's just details oh man that's awesome the inks all came individually bottled which i appreciate and we'll get into that and it even comes with a pen holder. I'm so sorry about the ink on my hands. The last set got a little bit crazy. And it has, it's not too, it's not as heavy as a letter opener. Oh, it has uh, little rhinestones. Look at that. Has two little rhinestones in there. Well, how about that? That's freaking pretty. It's having trouble. There we go. And then you just set you, one of your ink bottles in and it helps weight it down. And you can store your pen like that. And let's talk about the calligraphy pen. This set had really good reviews, which is why I bought it. It has a nice weight. The metal part, it 
has some weight to it, it but not too heavy or cumbersome can you guys see the detail it is gorgeous and there were so many comments saying how pretty this set was even the nib has some engraving on there it's probably a little hard to see on the camera but wow this thing is so freaking pretty i love it it, it seems to be well made i cannot wait we're, we're gonna have to just get in and try this out let me get some paper you guys and we're going to open and test all the inks and give this a go. All right, guys. So I went ahead and I took some scissors and just kind of broke the seal on each side so we can try this out. And each one has a saying on there. It says, write it on your heart that every day is the best day of life. I love that. Isn't that awesome? They don't have colors wrote on them. They just have these colored stickers on the top. So based on that, I'm going to assume that this is a purple ink please don't I hope these don't have those weird messy stoppers okay it does have a stopper but it doesn't seem to be as bad as the other ones this one came out pretty good my poor desk it's like what are you doing all right Man, this pen feels really nice in the hands, you guys. I feel like that's not... Oh, it looked like it wasn't picking up ink, but it is. Oh, you guys, this nib writes so good. Holy cow. Wow. I can't I'm <laughs> I'm kind of speechless over here because it really does write, like the feel of it is so different from just my everyday calligraphy pens that I have from Michael. So for example, I one of these is from Speedball brand, and then some of them are just starter ones from Michael's and or Hobby Lobby. So this is generally what I've been practicing calligraphy with and I will tell you guys this nib is like butter like butter all right so that's the purple I don't want to make this video too long I know some people enjoy um actually seeing the writing okay see that stopper stayed in the lid so I'll just have to put that one back in there man my poor hands Golly, this is nice. It's like not dragging the paper at all. If you guys have starter calligraphy pens like I do, then you know exactly what I'm talking about. I didn't know some people actually use calligraphy pens for art, but when I was reading reviews on Amazon, I saw where a lot of people use them for fine details, like, like in their, um, what do you call that, anime? Man. Look at that. Golly, I love this thing. I just cannot wait. Brian loves, loves when I write him letters and 
um, when we first started dating, I would write him little letters and seal it with my wax stamp. I just love that. And he loved it. And he's kept all those letters, which is funny because he generally, the only thing he keeps are old shirts. Why do guys do that? Golly. This pen is awesome. I cannot wait to try out the other nibs. Got a little ink bubble that popped. So we'll try out the red, which is just great for holiday um, colors as well. Look at that. I can bring you guys in closer. Don't mind my doodling. I'm just testing what all it can, what all it can do. Don't judge my actual doodles, okay? Look at that. Look how easy. Oh my goodness. I freaking love this set, man. And this is by the brand GC Quill. If you guys want to know, because I think they have some other sets, and based on the quality of this one, I am uh, about to go see. Ooh, run out of ink. I'm about to go see what else they have available. I'm very much like that. When I get something that's quality and I get excited about it, I instantly go see, okay, what else do you guys have? Let me check that out all right they have a black but no one probably wants to see black so i will do this yellow because i am quite intrigued to see what that looks like it's very translucent wow that's really nice Golly, this is so freaking cool. It gets really yellow once that red's off there. I need to get some more pen cleaner. I thought I had some in my desk, and, and then I remember I threw some away. Because I had it, like, in my desk forever. You guys, you guys, this set is a winner. It's it's a winner. Like aesthetically, yes, but quality and functionality, yes. You know, there's a difference in, you know, buying it because it looks cute on your desk. It gives you a vintage aesthetic. This performs. I love this thing. Love, love, love it. I think you guys will probably be seeing this on Instagram or in upcoming videos if I'm able to incorporate some writing in there. It is gorgeous. Not to mention you get that letter opener, a full set of inks. And just for comparison of this set to the dip pen, this is general the glass dip pen set. This is generally the size ink you get with most of the sets on Amazon. And with the GC Quill, you get the larger bottle. So the value is really good. Again, I think this set came in at $20 something like that. Watch Amazon. The link will be down below. Price goes up and down. This is a complete set. The inks are really vibrant and pretty. Yellow, red. We've got a green, a purple, and it came, oops, it came with a black, which is nice as well. A classic black. So you have some holiday colors in there. You've got some fun colors if you're going to write your friends, spruce up cards, things like that. I love this set. If you guys like writing or you're getting into it, I do recommend this set because of how easy, like my other pens do not write like this. They just, they don't, they don't, they just, they don't compare you guys. Oh, anyway, you guys, I'm not going to talk too much because I already talked too much. Just go get this set. Do yourself the favor. I'm going to go play around. I'll see you guys in the next video.